One Texas Street, and a camera captures the most Canadian crime ever. Cody's here with your two minutes of mayhem, eh? <laughs> okay, that That's was a great, great line. Right? <laughs> the most Canadian crime ever. That was awesome. Bravo, Tessa. Yeah. Bravo. All right, creepy Halloween decorations <laughs> are the least of parents' worries in one Texas neighborhood. Their concern comes in a small, furry little package an unassuming creature that climbs trees, ivy, and front yards. It's a stinging caterpillar oh. called an asp or a puss moth. Caterpillar. Oh, uh, okay. Don't say that fast. Right. Uh, hidden between the caterpillar's soft fur are venomous bristles that can oh. break off into your skin if you touch them. Dang. Experts say the caterpillars typically show up this time of year in the Houston area and don't usually go away until the winter. This is normally an animal that you would find adorable. Uh, yeah, it's very cute. Look at it. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh he's so cute. Aww. I would say. You know, like Hi. Australia, I'm convinced that everything in Australia is trying to kill you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it will eat you. <laughs> now, oh, yeah. stinging caterpillars in Texas. Jeez. All right. A Pennsylvania home is ready for Halloween and hopes to set the world record to boot. Blair Murphy, you know Blair Murphy. Oh, the Blair yeah. Murphy. Uh, yeah, Blair Murphy's home in Somerset County uh, features, among other things, a giant Ouija board nope. on its roof. <laughs> it's 44 feet by 25, uh, 29 feet. And Murphy says he's oh. talked with Guinness Book of World Records about possibly getting into the book. And they said, ah, all right, whatever. Uh, <laughs> Murphy is a Los Angeles filmmaker who care. randomly bought the structure online. <laughs> Murphy has opened up the home for tours Friday and Saturday. Courtney, uh, what time will you be there? Uh, what time are you going? You uh, know, I just remembered I uh -huh. have a thing. No, not going to do it? No. No. Nope. Mm. Would you rather see a furry caterpillar or a giant Ouija board? Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna caterpillar. <laughs> really? Caterpillar. So I'm caterpillar. Ouija board. Okay. <laughs> I, what? I don't know what's on the other side of that Ouija board. That's true. Fifty-fifty. <laughs> uh, and in the most Canadian crime ever, a thief broke through the roof of a sporting goods store last weekend, swiping a whole lot of high-end hockey sticks. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what? He drilled a hole through the roof. The thief got right to the heart of uh, Monkey Sports on Brunswick Boulevard. Oh, yeah, it's the sports. one on Brunswick, not the one on Fairfield Boulevard. Oh, right, yeah, right, right. That one's fine. Uh, the caper spent about an hour in the store. He wasn't in a hurry. He selected sticks priced at $300 a pop. Oh, gosh. Adding up to about $150,000. Wait a minute, what? Wow. Oh. Uh. It's a stick, right? right. Yeah. It's a stick. Yeah. There you go. All right. That's a boo It's a boo Bye bye. That'll do. Where? That'll do. Let's go check in with Courtney. Get a look at your own.